If Tara was here, she'd ask how the hell I can get lost in a place that basically has one road. Damn, I already miss San Francisco. And to wrap up this news report, we still have no information regarding Crystal Hugens, 23 years old, who disappeared one month ago while she was staying at Motel 9 in Sand Stove Creek. She was wearing a yellow windbreaker and carrying an urn containing her mother's ashes. If you see her, call... Aw, oh, now that's heartwarming news. Thanks, Death Valley. <sighs> I think I've been driving for five hours now. Yep, I'm doing it, Fog City. Cheating on you for the weekend. I can't believe this thing's still hanging in there. Memories are pretty sturdy little things. <sighs> no more cigarettes. Sorry, Nils. There's no place to hide. Oh, black coffee. Would I still look human without you? Look out, Las Vegas. Jade Lacroix is on her way. What the fuck? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, breathe. Relax. Oh, it was just a, a panic attack or something. Oh, you need to pull over. Oh, anywhere. Quick. Oh. thing back there on the road. Oof. I don't even want to think about it. Wow, this thing looks prehistoric. I should introduce it to my car. Crystal, still missing. She was in the neighborhood when she disappeared. Too tired to call anyone for the moment. I need to refocus. Crystal Huygens. This girl's face is everywhere since she disappeared. Her family must be actively searching for her. I hope she just found a better place to live. Smile, Jade. Damn, I hate these things. Paranoia makes me paranoid. Gee, wow, would you look at this? Folders. Some people call that freedom. It comes in all different calibers. Ooh, you're the special room. Nice. Oh, I should buy one of those for the apartment. Tara would love it. Come visit our big nothing. The most amazing nothingness you'll ever visit. I love the desert. Shut up, you evil machine. How nice to share your junk food remnants with the clients. In a movie, a young genius would hack the Pentagon with this thing. Nice sound. So, what now? Hello? Hey. I'm gonna need your ID card. Man, this guy looks like he's waking up from a 10-year nap. How old is he? He looks like he's got a few lives under his belt. Pretty sure he's from around here. Probably grew up in this land. 
poor guy. <laughs> Still might make a good character for my book. No ID card. Oh, my no ID room. card. I left it in the car. I hope. Here you are, you fragile official proof of my existence. Okay. Now I hope he's not going to stare at my picture for too well, long. Well, about time. Enjoy your stay. Some pretty interesting things to see around here. Huh. A missing persons ad. Crystal Huygens. Wow. It's the girl they talked about in the radio news. Is this guy a relative? The yellow tape really livens up the space. You've done a great job with this place. What? Did I do something wrong? He's looking at me like I've done something wrong. A police investigation? My sixth sense tells me this could be Crystal's room. The last place where she lived. My five other senses say this is seriously creepy. Doesn't work. No matter how hard I try, it will still be the wrong key. <sighs> what am I doing here, Tara? God, I wish you were here. Next time I'll think twice before running off. You're mine now. Jade's sacred place. Land of the Nap. TV? Phone? Maybe I will survive this place after all. Still hot out there. This desert is definitely one big, majestic emptiness. The sofa looks okay. Not sure about that painting, though. Hey, bed. Can you make this day a distant memory? No more being tired, no more monsters. And, uh, while you're at it, how about a few ideas for my book? Or some instant money in my bank account. Oh, I must be dreaming already. Hey, Tara, you're here. It's our room in San Francisco. sleepless nights. I'm so sorry for you. I'd give you some hours of my sleep if I could, baby. I hate to see you pacing like an animal in a cage. I know how sad you get. Why can't I reach you? I wish I could touch you right now, warm you up, give you everything I got. 
It's 4 a.m. I'm writing. You're counting the hours. Here I am. Not such a great shot of me, but uh, Tara insisted on keeping it. Going nuts or what? Man, I really need to clear my head. Let me talk. You don't know what you've stepped into. The motel where you're staying was built on lies. It's dangerous, like this whole region. Some folks know, but they keep letting people come here. People like you. Leave as fast as you can. We don't call it Death Valley for nothing. Well, that was, uh, interesting. Absolutely not spooky. Everything's fine. I think I'll give this reading a pass. Looks like a live forecast of my brain. Locked. D did I do that? Where's the key? One of Tara's and my favorite albums. Found it in a store before leaving the city. Very good deal. stuff in there. Come on, Jade, you're supposed to have set this code. Okay, need to find it somehow. I have no idea what this means. Reminder, next time you leave yourself a reminder, remind yourself to be more explicit. To, but you know I can't. Yeah, because these days when I write, I spend more time chewing my nails than typing, okay? Oh, and I thought I was a pro. Even six books later, writing scares me like I was a kid or something. <sighs> Why did I leave? It was so... so oh, shit! No! 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 Shit! It saw me! It's us, Tara and me, on one of the good days. War, definitely something that makes you feel right at home in your motel room. I'm not sure why this is here, but I'm glad it is. Time to get that door open. Oh, Tara, I miss you. It was so stupid to leave like that. Oh, 
Gosh, the screwdriver's useless on this, but maybe I can still put it to good use. I'm in. Now let's find that key and get out of here. how I got there, but my head hurts and I don't care. It's time to get out of here. Oh God, no! Stay away! Stay away! Don't move. Just don't move. Okay, did it. Holy shit! No, no, no! Focus, damn it! Oh, no. Uh, no. Wait, that's the guy from the reception desk. Was that a dream? Are you kidding me? Rough night, huh? It's the desert. It does that to some people. And now, a You'll quick weather update from the National Weather Service. We've received news of a sandstorm currently rising in Sandstove Creek, Death Valley. It is strongly recommended to avoid going out except in case of emergency, and to lock all your doors and windows. Power cuts, service shortages, and sudden darkness are possible throughout the storm. So above all, remain calm. I need something to calm myself down. Coffee. No, not coffee. A cigarette. I don't have any. I am so screwed. It's the White House, my favorite bar. It's... Wow, it's the night I met Tara for the first time. You were so beautiful. I think that night when I saw you, I discovered how empty I was. How much space there was left for someone like you. You look at me. And then this eternal fear is... This fear of the world, which is the only thing I know, this black fear that forces me to write, disappears. And there's only you. In your eyes, just a, a welcoming curiosity. I don't know it then, but in a few minutes we'll start talking and, and it will last for hours and, and then years. Still so full of you, Tara. The dream was too real. Damn, I need coffee. Empty. Story of my life. Empty again. Story of my life, part two. There's still a bit in there. 
Oh, I guess I'm saved. with the damn screwdriver. All right, good. Now let's try to think and... God, this is so sick. Uh, I can't fucking believe this. I drive 400 miles just to get burglarized in this hole? Well, luckily, they weren't trying to steal my new manuscript, because, uh, there isn't one. Who called me? Nobody knows I'm here. That guy again? The one from yesterday? <sighs> Weather forecast talked about a storm. Seems the sky didn't get the memo. Even the paintings? Why? detaching itself. Looks like there's something behind it. What is this, a door? In a damn closet? Locked. What did you expect? It's me again. Listen, I can help you get away from this place. Stay away from that guy, Wesley Argos, the receptionist. He's involved, and he's dangerous. I'm waiting for you in the parking lot. I know what you're thinking, but the truth is I'm the only friend you have right now. Come right away, to the parking lot. Okay, this is getting better and better. Who is that guy anyway? And who are they? And what the hell am I still doing here? They missed the point. It's not on the walls. It must be behind it. Behind the frame. Not one of these parallel dimension things. I really hope that dude is not around anymore. Okay, time to come out of the closet. <laughs> the second time in my life. This is beautiful somehow, but it doesn't seem from this world. <sighs> kind of like me, I guess. I've already seen symbols like this. Uh, what do they call them? Uh, sounds like NASCAR and... NASCA! Giant drawings in stone they found in Peru. Looks like someone got their nose inside her suitcase. Probably the police. symbols. She was obsessed. Drugs, maybe? Drugs make me see unicorns, so why not? 
Crystal Huygens. No doubt that's definitely her. All her stuff is still here. She clearly didn't just leave. This is so strange to disappear like that. Weird. How does it open? Could I... Weird. These crucifixes sound like they're connected to some kind of mechanism? Hmm. There's something going on here. Locked. How am I gonna get out of here? I'm not even supposed to be here. Oh, wow. It's an altar. This must be Crystal. The older woman must be her mother. The deceased. This is an urn. Oh, Crystal. No child should have to carry their mother's ashes. Someplace else. It still needs a piece. The last one, I guess. Some kind of key. Nice craftsmanship. Can't wait to open your secret little box, Crystal. Tara, I figured out a riddle for once. Huh. Well, this place definitely has interesting closets. In a world of keys, must it be the ones that make you free?
It's over. You're safe for now. Out of order? Are you kidding me? Okay, Jade. You can do it. Remember those electronics classes. Rip a fuse. That'll do the trick. That's it. What? What have I done wrong? What did I miss? Come on now, fit the hell in there. Oh, yes, yes, thank you. Not this one. Yes! <laughs> Good. Now close yourselves already. Now! Faster! Okay, so it took me a while, but I finally finished it. Hey, look. I wanted to make you a deer, but I'm not very good at this. So it eventually turned out to be a dream catcher. It'll catch your most perverted dreams, too. You okay with that? Ever seen a dream catcher blush? You better love it. I put my whole heart into it. And some of my blood, too, because I cut myself when I made it. Should I put it here? That way you'll think of me whenever you see it. But keep your eyes on the road. It'd be too bad to end up in a cactus. <laughs> Dirty bed sheets, as in Petri dish. The laundry room. Damn, it's cold. Or is it just me? Better get used to it. I'm not going back up there. <sighs> laundry stuff. <sighs> now that's fascinating. <sighs> it's not switched on. Technical skills never cease to impress me. Should work now. Sorry, little red Soviet plane. My life kind of depends on beating your ass. Pretty good at waging war for a pacifist. Playing rodeo on a working machine will probably end badly for me. I'm no bronc rider. Nice. This is out of order. Yeah, nothing lasts forever, my friend. It's always the smallest things that stand in your way. Don't start staring at this thing, Jade. coin-sucking monster. I hope it's okay now. I've got other stuff to take care of. I'm like leaving this place in one piece. An opening at the bottom of a 
the washing machine? Okay, it's the only way out anyway. This one's broken. <laughs> Always the one I pick. It made a click. That's a good sign. Pretty sure I'm not supposed to see it. What kind of dirty stuff are they trying to hide in here? Through the washing machine, a dark tale about Jade getting into deep shit. Nice. This may come in handy. Folders. That makes a lot of paper. It's crystal. The girl that vanished. I, I don't get it. Have they all disappeared? Is it a spy thing? Is the government behind this? The Russians? Come on, it's back! It's back! Oh no! Move! Move! He must be about 25 or 30. This is not only about women. What's going on here? Fighting communism. Wow. Don't tell me this is all about the Cold War. These paintings have known better days. Typical, leave it here and forget it exists zone. Looks like this hole's made to fit a handle. Modern technology. We have electricity. Not a bad idea. Doesn't anything work around here? Hey, look, it needs some fuses. I should be able to get this ladder down. I should. One more fuse to go. Trapdoor's free. There's your way out, girl. You just need to get to it.
It's really gone. some elbow grease. It's really gone. You see, he made it. Now get out of here quick. You need to warn people. The cops or the army or whoever has a gun and is still sane. Maybe even write something about this if you survive. A bedroom? Ugh. It smells like nobody has ever opened a window here. This is surreal. Looks like an official document. Hide the tape in a safe place. Okay, sure, but in a pizza box? Seriously? Hey, if this is a dream, would somebody please wake me up now? Ah, I think this guy has never even heard of water. Either this guy is a master cynic or a first-class patriot. Man, this guy's about to tear the desert apart. I haven't missed anything good. 4 p.m. That sky looks really pissed off. This is Wesley Argos, Ground 2 agent, code 658. Yes, we've got a problem. The new girl, Jade LaCroix, she's pulling away from the path. No, no, she's restless. It's like she's running away from something. But I don't know what's happening to her. It's been a month since Crystal Hugens crossed the threshold, and that's too long. Shh, she's please. got to go to the oh, end of the pilgrimage. Wait. What? He's talking listen, about listen. Me. I'm paid to do hell? one job, no and that's to make nothing. sure LaCroix Not gets to the destination. Oh, what do you want exactly? Her, Another me. disaster like at 63? Yes, I'll take care of it, but I'm gonna need backup. Sent Taylor. Someone might be helping the girl. Wow, that's one thriving bacteria farm.
No tape in there, but huh, just doesn't seem to work anyway. No tape in there, but huh, just doesn't seem to work anyway. of recordings. All the rooms. Must be all the clients of the motel for years. What is this place? A giant peep show? Man, I am in deep trouble. Here we go. The secret tape mentioned in the secret letter in the mysterious pizza box. It was only in sleep mode. Easy, like a hacker from one of those B-movies. Hold on a sec. What if... What if I call the phone booth? Yeah, that might work. It could fail too, but... Oh, come on, Jade. Just do it. I've already seen this trailer around. He must belong to the guy putting up those missing persons posters. Well, since he's the only other person I've seen here. Hold on a sec. What if... What if I call the phone booth? Yeah, that might work. It could fail too, but... Oh, come on, Jade. Just do it. Oh, God, this can't be true. It's my room. My stuff. Oh, oh God. He probably filmed me naked. Shit, this guy has turned his bedroom into a surveillance center. Must be Wesley's room. That guy from reception. Hold on a sec. What if... What if I call the phone booth? Yeah, that might work. It could fail too, but... Oh, come on, Jade. Just do it.
We'll call you at 4 p.m. for your weekly debriefing about Jade LaCroix. Be there. They sound military, but like... twisted military. I'm being hunted. By my own country. In my own country. What do I do? Surrender's not an option, huh, Tara? Well... I can still use this to create some kind of diversion. I don't know who's writing this crazy story, but I better not die in it. Or whatever your name is. I'm out of this mental circus. The reception desk. I can't stay here. I gotta hurry. to remind you of some basic rules That's him. He was putting up the missing hey! girl posters. You're not I I safe here. Him. They're going to hurt you. You need to come with me. Come on, Jade! We need to get out of here now! Hey! I stop have things right to tell you! You're going nowhere! I need you, you hear alive! Me? You can't leave! No, 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 not this! Jade! You gotta trust me! Hurry! No, please, no! I don't wanna die! I'm out of here now! Am I hurt? Oh, I guess not. Nice job back but there. He, oh my god, he got hit. Uh, it was a close call. <coughs> it's okay. It's just a hole, right? Hugens. Gary Hugens. That's my name. I'm the one who called you, on the phone. We don't have much time. You're doing a good job anyway. You're resisting them. It drives them crazy. They're not used to it. We lost them for the moment, but they won't let you leave. Listen, this, all this, it's a very old story. No one wants to tell. The motel, this military base of the desert, the experiments they did back there in the 60s, thousands of people who disappeared without a trace. <coughs> it's all connected. For a long time, I've thought the army was behind this. But no, it is way older. People go into the desert never to be seen again. It's a sort of... Pilgrimage, but with no return ticket. You think the government would try to stop this? <laughs> they just stand there watching. Making sure everything goes the way they want. It's Wesley's job! That pig! He 
He's in a state of shock. I need to find him water. He's hurt. I don't know what to do. Is there water here? He's in a state of shock. I need to find him water. The missing persons posters. I can't imagine what Gary's going through. I'm gonna need this. Paris. Do you remember Tara? Victims, Crystal. I know her story. Twenty-three years old. <coughs> her life was all about art, drawing. She learned from her mother, who was a painter. A normal passion for a normal girl. My little girl. Her mother died six months ago. I never managed to fill the void. I was demolished. I didn't see her slip away from me. Now she's gone. I lost them both. But that's how it works, you see. The people who come here, they all lost something. Someone. They felt the call. <coughs> and I feel it too, deep inside. Me and you, we're here for a reason. But you need to keep fighting. Life is worth it. Come on. Oh, damn, he's heavy. Remember, Jane, you learn once. You know how to do this. Come on, Gary. I've never seen someone die, and I don't plan to now. No, stay with me, Gary. Stay. I need to thank you. There's something in the desert. Don't go there. Leave. Get as far away as possible from this place. Oh, it's so dark here. I... I, I know that sound. It's my book. The one I wrote for Tara. I was afraid. More afraid than for any other book. Because she matters more than anything. She read it out loud. And in her mouth, the words finally found their shape. How you doing today? I've seen the doctor. He told me you're doing better. He says you're fighting it all right, baby. And you're kicking ass. You're my badass, honey girl. Oh, my head. I... Oh, Gary. Oh, I'm so sorry. How did it end like this? I hope you found your father. He's a good guy. Door's locked. There must be a key somewhere. Nothing. No sign of a key. It's 
empty. That's the year the experiment to this special ground too began. Huh. An important date in the history of bad ideas. The worst seems to have passed. There's no key on him. This must be it. Okay. Be brave, Jade. You're not a little girl anymore. Huh. No one. I thought... Well, at least the storm's gone. Need to find the road now. Oh, God, I'm exhausted. I want to disappear into your arms, Tara. I need your fingers walking up and down my spine. I wasn't expecting this, but it's better than square miles of sand, I guess. It doesn't work. Could find something useful in Gary's trailer. It's relative. What is this? A bunker? That smell, ugh. <sighs> you found yourself another lovely place, girl. It looks abandoned. It smells like old chemical stuff. I might be poisoning myself right now. Huh. <laughs> Just another casual hike through the desert. Keyhole. Locked. Why are you locked? Why don't you just trust me? One small key for me, but one huge step forward towards freedom. I hope. And that's it. Look who is hiding in there. William T. Davis, physicist. Ooh, you were a real smoker. Still smells of tobacco.
That's it, just like in sci-fi movies. Except I could really die on this one. You're supposed to be my map, Tara. You always have been. <sighs> and now I'm lost. I can barely feel my legs. Damp sand, like a vicious caress under my feet. <sighs> Got to keep going. It's a cemetery. Not Christian. Native American. Timbishan? I don't mean to disturb anybody, just passing through. Problem with this world. There's always a lock on something. Looks like. yeah, it can be removed. Wesley knows about this place. It's the heart of everything. I hope he's not after me. These planks are old. They're pretty loose. This is no time to get a splinter in my finger. That kind of stuff makes me faint. Here we are. Okay, no more chance of my frying my butt on that fence. Got to get to the end of this thing. Not that I want to be pessimistic, but uh, I'll never fit through here. Done. Time to get to the other side. Not sure the grass will be greener there, but uh, hey, at least sand is equally disappointing from wherever you look at it. So this is special ground, too. Looks like this place was really confidential back then. Before they all ran away from it. Why? Gary said they messed up. Whatever it was they were doing here, they decided to stop interfering and keep watching from the motel. <laughs> Introducing Wild Rifle Wesley. Sand. They were studying this place. Upsetting it. Did they create that thing that's been following me? Woke it up by mistake? Or on purpose? Did they think my life was so boring that it needed something like this? Locked, but not electronically. Just needs a good old key.
welcoming. The doors have the same indicators. Leave me alone! They say that only he who already knows what's behind the door has the right to open it. Me? I don't have a clue. I say who cares, let's go. Nicholas Leo, geologist. Tiny black spots on this one. Is it ink or some weird alien substance? Ground two. You're here. Whew, this stuff is... This stuff is too much, even for me. And man, have I written weird things, but this... Wait, if ground two is there, what are those other spots? Russia? Africa? Okay, later. to do with all this it activates the bridge but there's no power
Okay, this is the beginning of something. Wow, did I do that? Must mean power's coming back soon. Jade? It's me, baby. Tara. I never wanted to hurt you, you know. It's you. Your fear did this. It turned me into a monster. I hate this thing. But it's gonna be okay now. I know. You were afraid. By running away from me, you were running away from the past. Now you can see the truth with wide open eyes, and we can be together again. I won't abandon you this time, I promise. It's a crater, you know. It's extraordinary what it does. I was floating into darkness, and then it made me come back for you, Jade. Okay, you decided to make a monster of me, but hey, nobody's perfect. The crater is not a bad thing. It's a door. A thousand doors, actually. It doesn't kill. It just changes the way things are. It's gonna be all right. We can still be together. But you need to trust me. I know it's not easy after all that's happened, but... Let's leave all this madness behind. The dark days are over. It's a new life. You just have to follow me. It's now, babe. It's your call. I can't stay here, Jade. You need to decide. Come with me or say goodbye. No, no, I don't want to be here. Stop messing with my head, whatever you are. Stop it. You hated being photographed, but when I took this one, you said nothing. You knew you were about to go. Only this would remain of you. A frozen picture on paper. Oh, I... oh no. Tara, no. Wake up, please. It's just a dream, do you hear? It's a trick. A lie. It can't be. Oh, I need you to be alive. Oh, come back, please. I need you. I was the one living in a dream, Tara. A dream where you were still alive. Now the dream has ended. It's time to wake up to a new world. Everything here looks like it's here I am. And the heart of ground, too. So this was what the fog was hiding. Tara called it a crater. Did something fall from the sky here? It's unreal, Tara. I... I'm sorry, but I'm kind of terrified right now. I guess there's no turning back. No? Yeah, I knew that. It's okay. Is that a nuclear bomb? Is it still active? Gary said the army messed up with the crater. They wanted to seal it, but... Wes, see, do you still love me, Tara? Even like this? Well, I guess it doesn't matter what you are. I loved you as a memory, as a dream, even as a ghost. I guess this is what truly drives a pilgrim in the end. Love. Okay, girl. I'm coming with you. Show me a world. Many things.
things break in our lives all the time. And I'd like to say that there's no need to be afraid. Yet, if nature is constantly trying to fill the absence of light, doesn't that mean it knows fear? Fear of emptiness? Of what is not? That's what makes Special Ground 2 so special. It's a constant hole in reality. A never-ending beginning. Today, I still have doubts that all of this really happened. I just know it's okay to be afraid. And I'm sure of one thing. This world has many special grounds. And one day or another, we'll go.